Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. I wanted to share my skincare routine, the one that I'm using right now. This has evolved over time, but I'm gonna share with you the current skincare routine that I have. So there's some basic fundamental pieces to my skincare routine. Number one is having some sort of cleanser. So a cleanser that will actually clean your skin off. Number two is having some kind of medication that you're using to actually clean your skin. Whether that's an over-the-counter treatment, just a topical that you're getting at like a CVS, or if that's something that you're getting prescribed, right? But some kind of kind of treatment that you're putting on your skin. And then wrapping that up with a moisturizer of some kind. So I'm gonna show you the products that I use and how I use them. Um, and then we'll take it from there. So I use Curology, um, and you're seeing this in a mirror, so it is backwards, but I use Curology, and it comes with a cleanser, a moisturizer, and then a cream that is specially designed for you, your skincare needs, right? So um, basically, Curology gives you the full pack. But I, I add to that, right? So I also, at the moment, I'm taking a couple of more prescription grade creams that my doctor thinks are good right now. So one is a Trentinoin uh, cream, and the other is an antibiotic cream that I'm being prescribed. So I start by just a wash, right? Um, I'm gonna, the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm wash my hands to make sure there's no kind of bacteria or anything on my hands themselves. And then once my hands are still clean while the water is still running, I'm just gonna splash some of that warm water onto my face, right? So. Oh. Alright, so now my face is my face is wet, and I'm gonna apply the cleanser. So I have this Curology cleanser. I'm just gonna apply a small amount here, rub it between my fingers to kind of build up a lather. And I like to get a good kind of I like to get a good lather going on my face, and then I splash some more warm water on that to rinse it off. So now my face is dripping wet. The next thing that I have is a dedicated towel that I only use for my face. So I hang this in a spot where other people aren't gonna use it, but I have a dedicated towel that I just use. So I don't wanna use the same towel that I have touched my hands on, that I've dried myself off with. I wanna have a separate towel entirely. Take that dedicated towel, kind of pat my face dry. There we go. Nice. So now, if it were the evening time, I would then apply this. Uh, this is the treatment that I get from Curology. It contains uh, a specific facial treatment for my skin, right? So you submit pictures of your own face and then basically a team of dermatologists decides what treatment you should receive uh, for your skin. So this is like specially created for my face. But in the mornings, I just put on just some moisturizer. So while my face is still wet, I want to just put a couple of drops of moisturizer on my finger and then rub that into my cheeks, across my nose, and on my whole face. Now, it's so the way this works, basically, is the cleanser and moisturizer I'm using twice a day, right? So I'm washing my face and I'm moisturizing it in the morning, I'm also doing that before bed. The difference is that at night, I also add this cream that I put on before I go to sleep. So this is a one a day treatment that I'm using to combat my acne and keep my skin in relatively good health. You know, occasionally I might add some other products, but I feel like there's maybe like a spot treatment that I need. So sometimes I put on just a little bit of a kind of intense acne spot treatment, right? So you can buy these different ones that basically just, you put a little dot on where the actual pimple is and it helps kind of reduce that redness and swelling. So occasionally I'll use something like that. But for the most part, that's kind of my basic routine. You know, I'm using Curology products, but you could totally emulate this with something else, right? So one of the things that happens is that the Curology comes and you receive it every six weeks. And by that last week, usually I'm running out of the different products. So last time I, I ran out of the products. And so I went to my Walgreens and I got a just night facial moisturizer and I got a foaming facial cleanser. So basically these are kind of analogous to the, the cleanser and the moisturizer from Curology. A CeraVe cleanser. Oh, you didn't know? And then this is just a night facial moisturizer from Walgreens, right? So neither of these are anything fancy, but they work, they, they do the trick, right? So in the same way, this washes all the oils kind of off of your skin and this provides that like moisture to your skin so you're not producing excess oils at night. You could totally add some kind of over-the-counter product 
in between those. But that would be my recommendation, right? So kind of a warm, a warm water wash of the actual skin. If you are gonna apply something, apply it in that window and then apply that moisturizer while the face is still damp. So you're trapping in some of that moisture, you're getting it to actually absorb into your skin. So that is my current skincare routine. It's nothing fancy, it takes me about three and a half minutes to do, but I'm very religious about it. I think during college, I never skipped a night. Even after like a night of partying, I still would like come back and make sure I did my facial routine. These are things that like getting into the habit of doing them every day really gives you good returns down the line. So making sure you have a good cleanser and make sure you have a good moisturizer, I think are the two kind of keystones. And then you can add in that extra piece if you need a little boost. That's what I do. I hope you guys found that useful. Uh, and I will see you all next time. Thanks so much for watching.